And here we are, chat. So we're doing some more Pokemon Legends today. Wanted to relax with that. Now, they actually updated this game. And uh, I've been playing so much of it that I still have like eight hours worth of uh, VODs to upload to YouTube. <laughs> I'm not entirely fully sure on what's been updated. I just kind of watched the trailer and it just kind of showed a couple things. I Like uh, Alpha's being able to show up in swarms now. Anyhow, the game is in fact updated. Let's go with the Mr. Mime thing, I guess. Or, I was at Fieldlands last time. Ah, why not? Let's just go to it. Now, for the post-game I was working on, the last thing I did was I caught Heatran. I found a couple of legendary layers, though, and there was just nothing there, which was a little annoying. Hang on, can I craft anything? Let's do that. Nope, not what I want. Pebbles there. Sell those later. Don't need to keep these with me. Uh, you know what? I can use these Pokeballs up, actually. Why not do that? Don't want that. Should be fine. Boop, boop, boop. Tumblestone ain't gotta be carried with me. Good enough. Alright, now where is it at? All the way down there. Alright then. Let me go ahead and switch things up here. You have to talk to Mai for the new stuff. Okay, there's a side quest that makes it active. Mai's in Obsidian Fieldlands. Well, it looks like I'm in the right place. Okay. For now... Okay, Tentacruel's done. Let's swap that out. Um, right. Can I just evolve Kranidos right away? That was the last thing I caught. Mystery gift code they gave us. What does that do? Just give you more Pokeballs? In all honesty, I don't think I'd say no to that. Is it still active, or was it just yesterday only? I'm not sure. Well, there's Rampardos now. That's cool. Still active? Okay. No, no, no. I don't want to release. Don't want to release, indeed. Happini, Pichu, Pikachu is working on for some things, and Polian can get rid of that for now. Munchlax was friendship, right? So we'll take him for now. Let him do things in the, in the overworld. Right, I was raising this Gabite to evolve again, so let's just do that. It's not ready, is it? Okay, then. Uh, get password. Battery runs out or disconnected. You see, yeah, yeah, we know. What's the, what's it? It's Arceus Adventure. All caps. Okay. Can honestly use the Pokeballs right now. So. <laughs> Looks so weird like that. Searching for gifts. Item set. Save me some trouble, so why not? Receiving. Yeah, you got a present. I remember that, like, um, what was it? Brilliant Diamond? I think the, the Sun and Moon games came with it, too. But they came with, like, a code that gave you, like, what is it, like, a hundred po regular Pokeballs or something? <laughs> this is an okay gift, I guess. I mean, I'll take it. Saves me some trouble of running around crafting. Hang on, they're in storage. Nice. Okay, let's use these up, though, today. Just to save up a little bit. Alright, good, good, good. Now then... First, I'm gonna deal with this down here. Are you all good, chat? We sound good? Okay. It's a Starly. It's a Shinx. Oh, it's an Alpha Wormpole. 
Um, hang on. Let me catch that. An alpha specimen for that might be good. And there's another one. Okay. Who's up the great ball? We're just getting started today. Like, I say this every episode I do this, but, like, this is a game you can just turn on and run around. And it, it, even now, just getting updates right away. <laughs> I still got even more to do now, don't I? Okay, get in there, Munchlax. You're the friendship mon right now. Munchlax is certainly... Well, the friendship stuff in this game has kind of spoiled me for friendship evolutions in the other game. Like, uh, trying to evolve Crobat or into Crobat and Fool's Gold right now is, like, making me lose my mind. <laughs> Hang on. Let's grab this. Okay. Mimes are ancient history. Exactly. Well, that didn't come out. Lux rays. Just have a look around still. Picking up materials and doing this along the way. I definitely would be pretty down to play a sequel to this whenever it comes out. Probably not getting that for quite a while, though. Alright. Let me get this. I'm sure I'll find, like, uh, what the next legendary I need is, but... Probably when I'm done doing the side quests and stuff here, I'll probably just ask chat where the next one is. Because I found Giratina's lair, but nothing's there. So I'm guessing I have to do the post-game legendaries in a set order or something. All I've done is... Uh, yeah, Heatran and the three lake legendaries. And I'm pretty sure Shaman is a save is a save data bonus. I should try and do the Darkrai one today, though. Okay... Anyhow, I'm getting a little too antsy wandering around up here. I'm trying to see if I can find wisps. Thanks for all the subs, everybody. Appreciate it. This is, uh, the, we're still celebrating me doing three years of streaming. It's that weekend. It doesn't feel like it's been three, three years already. I was kind of surprised. I thought it was four years at first, but I had to double check. I mean, we've been recording doing YouTube stuff for a lot longer than that, but... Okay. Let's go do this. Dive properly. There's a mime. Um... Does Pikachu have Thunder Wave? I don't remember, actually. Yeah, it does. Okay. Okay, that worked. Number you caught without being spotted. That worked. I haven't even reached it yet. Catch the baby. Well, that worked. Thought for sure he got away already. Okay, there they are. Should probably make a save here. I forgot. I don't even remember what Shiny Mime looks like. This is kind of scary, seeing them just pop into existence like this. Oops. Let me check this here. I have to defeat a bunch of them too, but I may as well just get the capture for these. 
They're not attacking. Ew. Wait for it. There's one over there. Oops. Just standing there in my face taunting me. There it goes. I'm gonna fight this one because I don't like it. He's in the way. There was a glitch where some swarms could be invisible. Was that a thing? Okay. Patched, I guess, now. Did they fix any other glitches while they were patching in um this uh, update? We'll go we'll go find mine a bit. Looks like that's the last one. Let's take it out. Pop him. Get him, Pikachu. Make him pay. Alright. Game or er, battle audio, not too loud, I hope. Just because I know the game audio can get real loud sometimes when I go into battle. What about Gastrodon? Number defeated. Strong style move. Heavy specimens caught. Not too loud? Okay. I think I need Leaf Storm on this. Alright. Thanks for the gift subs again there, everybody. I appreciate it. More wholesome teddy bear emotes for everybody now. Let's beat up this one's parents. Okay, that's taken care of. Um, now where could my be? Maybe near the Heights camp? Oh, there she is. So we meet again. Been hearing plenty about your impressive exploits. But of course, I've always known you impress us ever since you dealt with that alpha cricketune for me. I've had my hands full as well. I've no idea why, but Munchlax keeps trying to run off in different directions. Munch. Munchlax, where are you off to? There he goes. I'm not sure what he's so focused on, but he just up and disappears without warning. Keeping track of him has been quite the task. Mun. Look at it. What was that? It almost seemed to be responding to Munchlax. Your arc phone is reacting to Munchlax and displaying his destination. Hmm, it's pointing to Romanus Island. My, isn't this exciting? I wonder if we're about to see another strange phenomenon sweep across Sisui. Munchlax just... To gave me the info on my phone, I guess. Perhaps I'm reading too much into things. Can I ask you to visit Ramanus Island to try and shed some light on this new mystery? That's a bit of a convoluted way to say it. It's like, hey, Munchlax wants to go somewhere, and your phone is like, hey, I know where somewhere is. I mean, it is the god phone, but, you know. <laughs> That's a kind of a funny way to just do that. Well... Let's head that direction, then. Fly away. 
Speaking of munchlaxes, though. Gonna pick up some stuff as we go. That's Junu down there. Those are Abra's teleporting. They wouldn't use they would use the place that would eventually become Pal Park to introduce it to something new, would they? Munchlax looks like a little friend. Problem is he he would eat all your food, and that's not cool. There's Chimchar. Hang on. Hey, sniped. There's the Infernape. I haven't seen any shiny alphas. I know people have been, like, trying to hunt those. Uh-oh. Too far. Don't use your jack balls like that, mister. This isn't what I'm looking for, but... Am I on... I'm on the island. Hang on, do I have to set the quest manually? I thought it did that. Is it a site or is it a request? I don't know. Just got the interest of Munchlax. I'm here. We gotta deal with this first. Oopsie. Have some food. You catch it. Drifloon. Well, I caught that one. Now I can see the damn marker. That's a very specific spot. Seems to be the place my Munchlax was interested in. <gasps> Look at those lads. They don't belong here. It's too warm for them. Look at them fluffy babies. Better report back to Mai about the Zorua. I'll be taking a couple for the road, though. Number defeated, number caught at night. Hey, what a coincidence! Caught unaware. Let's throw a ball at it, see what happens. Have 150 hours, haven't seen a shiny alpha yet. Okay. Oh, did it fall asleep? Oh, never mind. Hang on. Um. Let's do this. It says I gotta get the thing for catching them at night, so I may as well just catch them. Bitter malice. Don't hurt Pikachu. Let's do this. Caught a shiny Alpha Carnivine. That's nice. I feel like getting a shiny starter in these games is a pain in the ass, though. 
You can only get them from the distortion, because I imagine the actual starters you get from the professor are going to be locked. Here, let's intimidate it a bit. Oh, you darn messed up, little fox. Let's get him. Hey. Yeah, you don't have to KO the other Pokemon in order to throw a Pokeball. But I wanted to do that to the Drifloon anyway, to get, like, an extra check for Thunderbolt. Anyhow. I need to go back to my... I wonder if I should just take down the Alpha in a fight, because I can... I wonder if, like, any fan games or ROM hacks are gonna add, like, alpha Pokemon. That could be cool to see. It'd be really intimidating to just run into, like, a more powerful version of a regular Pokemon while you're playing, yeah. Friend got a shiny Cyndaquil last night. Little Cyndaquils are cute. Game is... Yeah, I stand in an awkward spot there, aren't I? Oh. Hang on, two Pokemon I got can evolve. First... Monkey. Can I evolve Pokemon while I'm waiting for something to be captured? <laughs> That's funny. Hmm. How will the alphas be for home? I'm not sure. They're probably gonna figure out some way to, like, convert their stats for, uh, something in Scarlet and Violet, for all we know. Maybe it'll change size? I don't know. I don't play the speculation game. I just see the cute grass cat, and I'm like, alright. I will wait until I can use it. Okay. Hey, another one caught. I, I'm, I'm wondering if there's going to be some glitches discovered by doing stuff like this. Like, catching a Pokemon and just, just, like, opening up a menu. And then just causing other shenanigans to happen. I mean, isn't that literally what uh, BDSP speedrunning speed was? Anything else around I want to get before I leave? Beat these up with the city Y. Much lax is leveling up. Get him to City Y. All right. What's on the tiny island again? Let me just get close and see if there's like a wisp or something. No, it's just. Oh, yep. Yeah. Lucky call there. Two wisp remaining in the area. Those are going to be a pain in the ass to find. I haven't, like, checked with the girl for finding specific ones yet. I've just kind of, like, been... Oh, there's Drifloon. Well, I've just kind of been, like, grabbing whatever, and I didn't mean to use that. There's an Alpha one. Sand Gem Flats. There's the Snorlax Canyon. They're still trying to attack me over there? Jeez. Let it go, man. I 
I know I could teleport back. I'm just kind of flying to see if I can see any wisps or anything. Hang on. Oh, Geodude's in there too. I'm not gonna bother with it then. Too long of battle. If you're flying over an area, can you hear the shiny sparkle if a Pokemon pops in? But if you're too far away, and, like, the Pokemon doesn't physically load in, does it not play? I don't know. I'm kind of wondering about that stuff now. I have seen two shinies. I got a shiny Burmy from a tree, and I caught shiny Cascoon from a swarm. You do hear the sparkle flying, okay. Done with your investigation? Please tell me what you found. A pack of Pokemon? That hardly tells me anything. What kind of Pokemon did you see? Those spiteful foxes. <laughs> okay, sassy main character. There was Zorua. A sp the spiteful fox Zorua. Well, you came across a rare Pokemon. I've seen them in the Icelands before, but not here. So, was that it, Munchlax? You were curious about Zorua. What? Why are there suddenly two of you? Well, this is unexpected. It seems there are two Munchlax now. But naturally, I would never fail to recognize my own Munchlax. It's you, right? Not the one next to me. The other one. One. Did that thing just use an ability? That's illegal! Abilities haven't been invented yet. Give it the program. So it was Zorua. Well, Munchlax. He's just looking up at her being like, Really? Thought we had something special, girl. How odd for it to appear in the field lands. Mun. I only hope this one that this isn't an omen of something unpleasant yet to come. As a precaution, it might be best for you to report this to your captain. I just realized, like, she's got like the uh Stantler on her leggings. That really looks weird to me. It looks like some kind of like Weird Christmas outfit, <laughs> now that I see the deer. Anyway, I should probably stop staring at her legs like a creep and actually go play the game. Report to Captain. Let's go back, Professor. You've caught 22 Pokemon. Yes, I did. Stantler leggings. <laughs> Made some new observations. What do we got? Doesn't matter. Newly completed entries, three. Nice. What'd you like to do? Let's go back home. Well, I started with the Mr. Mime Swarm. All right, <clears throat> pardon me. Let's go talk to Silene. And also see if uh, you're selling anything. Uh, mystery claw, mystery box, mystery claw would be for sneeze, all right. Uh, guess I should take them all. Forty thousand. Wait, this is Rotom Fan, isn't it? Okay. Okay. Upgrade. Oh, that's good. I need that. Do you need all the Rotom forms to complete Rotom's dex, dex entry? I'm assuming you do, but I don't think I got a pop-up when I use the fridge. Hmm. No request there, but first you. Yep, we got a new emote, Teddy Ursa Flash, and some money. It's cute. 
The gathering of Zoru in a place other than their natural habitat. Could this also have been caused by the space-time rift? Suppose we don't know enough to say for certain. At any rate, thank you for the report. Why do I need to go to her for this? 30 Ultra Balls. I'll, I'll take that. Munch. Asprey, things are growing worse. After we parted, Munchlack reacted to several different locations and there was a mass outbreak at each of them. Simultaneously in multiple locations. These must be somehow different from the mass outbreaks we know. Why don't we call this new phenomenon a massive mass swarm? Your new orders are to investigate the massive mass swarm. Sounds like I can count on you to keep investigating. Well then, I'll be waiting for you by the front gate. What about you? You're a talented Survey Corps member I keep hearing about, right? I have a favor to ask. You know the Orboro Tunnel? Yeah, the tunnel near Obsidian Falls. I'm hoping to dig into the tunnel wall to see if I can find any good stone there, but a Pokemon's been raging about and getting in my way. More than I can handle. Think you can calm it down for me. Sure. Thanks. Please head to the tunnel once you're ready to calm that Pokemon down. So... Did the outbreak... Like... No, sorry, not no. Um, did the update... Sorry. Can't talk. I, I heard some, some people say the update added a bunch of, like, more side quests, too. I guess we'll see about that. <laughs> Anyhow. We got Ultra Balls. <clears throat> Let's go talk to her. Uh, wait, no, I'm not talking to you. <clears throat> Jump. Jeez, sorry. I'm good. Suppose I should tell you what I found first. Munchlax suddenly took off running to a rainstorm. Tried to stop him lest he get wet, but then I saw the mass swarm appearing all over. <clears throat> Perhaps it was the swarm that Munchlax was so curious about. Mun. If that's the case, Munchlax might be able to help us investigate this phenomenon. Also work with you as I'm concerned about Munchlax. Okay. Hmm. Pardon me. Clear my throat. We can begin our investigation as soon as you're prepared. You ready to go now? Uh, no, not yet. I'll be waiting right here. I want to change my team out. Because I just evolved some mons. I want to swap them out. I should take out the Porygon, and I should see what needs to be used for Porygon 2. Like, Porygon 2's dex entry, because I better get that done before I evolve it to, like, you know, uh, Porygon Z. I mean, I'm gonna have to evolve multiple Porygon eventually, but you know what I mean. Okay, then. Uh, Porygon, Porygon... How long ago did I catch a Porygon? Where's my fridge Rotom? Four. Oh, wow, all the way back in four? Okay. There's a green bear chat. A green baby bear. Cut Magnazone. What else can we use here? Guard of War. I already did that. I don't really gotta worry about that. Raise another Sveal. Nah. I gotta evolve a Drifloon manually, so I could probably carry one of those with me. It would get lots of experience fast. Didn't I catch one? Yeah, I caught... No, I caught an Alpha. I can probably evolve this right away, actually. Hang on. I'll probably catch my own Teddy Ursa. Her own shiny Teddy Ursa. Before I, uh, evolve it. I wanna- I wanna gather so many green teddy bears, chat. I've also seen shiny Ursa Luna. It's not- not amazing. There we go. Alpha Drift Loon. There we go. This Rowlet's level 53, I could just evolve it right away and get all that. <laughs> Quite a few Pokemon you can always do that for. Alpha Wormpull as well. Hmm. Hmm. 
Mantyke. Okay. Uh, you know, these are next to each other. Let me just do this right now. Just so I can get the evolution check for Mantyke. Oops. Of course I did. Hang on. Works for me. I always forget that Mantine even has a baby. Alright. Um, maybe I could just keep Rimmel Raid with me then and evolve it by, um, training it. That'd be fine. Yeah. It's a ball Porygon. How shiny that looks. Now then, let me check the decks for it so I can see what it needs to do. Um Okay. Alphabetical is the easiest way to find things, I guess. Oops. Number times Thunderbolt and Recover. That's all I gotta do. Now, does it know those things right now? Nope. I guess I gotta let it just level up for a bit then. And it should learn them. Other than that, this is a nice team. Let me check Decidueye again. How close is Decidueye? Alright, Leaf Storm still needs to be 25, and so yeah, it's just Leaf Storm, Triple Arrows and Leaf Blade are done, but I still gotta do a few more strong and agile style moves. Decidueye is very close to being 100%, that's cool. Excellent. I guess I'm ready to go. They gave me 33, uh, 30 uh, free Pokeballs. Excellent. Off to the Heights camp, then. All right, let's give it a go. Yeah, today we're just going to relax with Legends, and then I wanted to do some Castlevania again after this. Haven't added to the uh, Castlevania Marathon playlist for a while, and I practiced Chronicles the other night. That was fun. We haven't seen anything out of the ordinary yet, nor has Munchlax reacted to anything. Shall we just wait for a while to see whatever happens? <clears throat> okay. Chronicles is a hard one, though. But anyhow, let's focus on this. We'll see that later. Figured it'd just be good for a one-off as well. Raining, and it looks like it's going to get worse. Mun. Are you worried about the rainstorm, Munchlax? We still don't know what's causing these massive swarms. Where should we look? Perhaps that fancy map of yours can show us something. Munch. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> Massive mass swarm is a phenomenon which many mass swarms occur at once. I'm avoiding the O word too much because YouTube thinks I'm talking about something else. Mass swarms locations are marked by question mark icons. You won't know a Pokemon can be there until you go see. If these rare swarms will dissipate in time, so you need to hurry to investigate them. Catch or defeat Pokemon in mass swarm before it dissipates to finish investigating that particular location. Sometimes additional Pokemon may appear after you complete your investigation. Seems you have some idea where to look for these swarms now. Why not check out a few? Seeing at least three ought to give us some idea what's going on. Alright. Let me sort my items right quick, though. Let's see if I can craft anything. Uh, more jet balls. And I guess more, even more ultra balls. Oh, just one? Alright. 
May as well make a star piece. And let's put some stuff away now. Deal with uh, getting Weavile later. Making sticky globs later. Hang on, can I make more sticky globs? I forgot about that. Need caster ferns for that. What's well, raining right now, chat? That means comfy time. Hmm. I need to carry these with me. Um, can I get a, use some candies up? Maybe Porygon. I mean, candies are kind of useless regardless, but I'm just gonna clear up the inventory slot and use them all in Palkia. <laughs> yeah, that, these the small ones are nothing. Small ones are kind of obsolete, because you can just go to a late game area and quickly get a bunch of uh, stuff. Anyways, let's go with this one right here. Excellent. Uh-oh. Yeah, I found them. I wish I knew they were Abra. <laughs> yeah, that's fun. I just scared them all immediately. At least this will help me get some Abra. Did they teleport away completely, or just to a different spot? I probably just, like, spooked most of them away with that, though. That's annoying. Oh. Dear. Oh, I caught it. Nice. Um... This one, I guess. Can only set one of those at a time. Good. Don't want to worry about that. Paris? Oh! It's Paris. Chat, they're coming for me. And I don't have Pokemon to really take them out easily. Rainstorm shows no sign of stopping anytime soon. You know what? Um, I'm going to a different one. I don't want to. I don't want to deal with that. And I can get that bag over there too. Paris is just annoying, and I don't even have uh, moves to like KO them fast enough. What is this luck so far? Yeah, my first swarm, I run into a bunch of Abra and they teleport away because I wasn't expecting Abra. Abra is actually pretty annoying to catch. It's like back in the day. Oh, gee, dude. Let's go. Okay. Is that... Is that Wormpole? Wormpole? Really? Wormpull. You know what? No, 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 no. I, I, I got better things to catch than this. Scrumpo. Okay, chat. You cannot tell me that that is an auto-generated name. Scrumpo? No. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I was already too far. Well, I saw one pop out of the ore deposits. Okay, I'm going to a different one. I'm going to a different one. I... I my time is better spent on rare Pokemon, not Wurmples. A swarm of Wurmple? You mean normal Wurmple? Don't give me that crap. <laughs> sea Weasels. What is it now? St Starly. Really? Starly? No. No. I'm... No! 
Okay, let's try this one. Is this supposed to happen, or am I just having abysmal luck right now? Oh, weird ear. No! A wild weird ear. You're having abysmal luck. Okay. Couldn't find weird ear in the wild before. Oh, it's level 62. Sorry, Pikachu. Wow, that didn't do too much. Okay. Should be good to try this now. Alright. That saves me the trouble of evolving another one later. This would be a chance for me to increase the amount of um, Stantler I, I need to beat, right? I gotta defeat a bunch of them. I haven't defeated any of them. It ran away. Okay. Gotta catch him by surprise then. Hang on. Do I have a food thing? No. Okay. Just go for it, mister. Ah. Oh, another weird ear. Hang on. Whatever. Ah. Oh. Rimmo Ray can evolve. Let's do this. Got him. Rimmo Ray can evolve. May as well just do that. I'm gonna revive Pikachu so it gets level ups. The Pokemon from these swarms are really high level. Were the Wormpool also level 60 chat? Were they? I didn't check. Come to think of it, what about the Abras? I didn't catch what level they were. Um, check moves on Porygon now. Nope, no new moves yet. Might have to learn it from that girl in uh, the city. All right. I'm just gonna enter a battle with it. Okay, not bad. Seeing it use Psy Shield Bash counts for me, I believe. Let's go. I don't think the old Chateau from Eterna Forest is in this game, Yo-Yo. Pretty sure it's not. Nice. Nice. Fight. Oh, this one didn't run. It's gonna regret that. Stantler made the right choice. Alright. 
Uh, looks like we still got it here. Let me take this one out. Turn around. Gonna take the chance and use strong leaf leaf storm. Ah, that's annoying, but I needed to see it anyway. Keep forgetting to revive. It's alright, I'm just gonna go back to a camp after this. Alright, that's that one taken care of. Okay, Porygon 2 got a new move. Oh, Munchlax can evolve already. Ugh. Meanwhile, I've spent like two episodes trying to get Crobat and Fool's Gold. <laughs> I gotta swap out the Mons now, too. Thunderbolt, there it is. I mean, it's Thunderbolt and Recover, right? Wait, what? Why does that one have a, a star? Wait, should I go to that one? And we'll explain later. Alright then. Uh, instead of going into camp and risking things resetting, I'm just gonna heal then. Whatever. I'm just gonna use my orange berries right now. How about that? Good enough. Should just mark it. I guess I'll go to the Starly one again. like he's the last one. Don't. Oh, how rude. Hope this kills. Alright, that worked out. So I've done enough now, it seems. The rainstorm ended. Uh, no more. That rock always blue. Seems uh, uh, dissipated. We may as well return to Jubilee Village and wait for another one to, well, break out. Okay, then. Let me swap my team a bit, then. Hang on. 
Um, I'm getting loaded up here, so I should probably start releasing some stuff. I don't need all these mimes. Or the Starly. Apra was level 15. Oh, wait, no, these ones are from a star thing. I need to figure out what that means first. I have a lot of extra Goomies. Don't need all these. Uh, I caught a bunch of Mothams here. That one's an Alpha. Alright, let's do that. And it should give me stuff, right? Oh. Do we not get stuff for releasing? Oh. There it is. Now then... Oh, hang on. I'm going to craft right quick. I need some more potions, don't I? Not really, I guess. Okay, let's head back. Show me what you should get. Here's you go, man. Only a little bit of money, but we're just checking out the, the new content right now. That's fine. Spends 18 hours a day sleeping. Even while asleep, Abra can control its psychic power. Should danger approach, it will simply teleport away. It has no discernible heartbeat and does not seem to draw breath. It appears to function without issue. I cannot even begin to explain this utterly bizarre anomaly. <laughs> the virtual Pokemon. The black orbs shine with an uncanny light when the Pokemon is erecting invisible barriers. The fur shed from its beard retains heat well and is highly useful material for winter clothing. Oh, Palkia is done. This Pokemon is a fair deity of the De uh, Suian legend. Birth of Palkia is what caused the walls of the world to disappear, creating the sky that spans for infinity. Alright, we'll figure this thing out later. Well, they don't know what computers are, right? Of course they don't know what the heck it is. There's a different deck entry for the Palkia's form. Hang on. Oh. It soars across the sky in a form that greatly resembles the creator of all things. Perhaps this imitation of appearance is Palkia's strategy for gaining Arceus' powers. Palkia plotting something? Oh, wait. Why is the markers there? Plate of moon view. Why do I have that? Hang on, I'm, why am I not set to the main quest in there right now? Oh, the plates? Well, not right now. Where's the request? It counts as that, doesn't it? New anomaly? So, I guess I don't have anything set right now. So I'm not supposed to see Silene again? I'm just supposed to, like, wait for it to happen or something? I don't know. We have progress to report. Alright then. I guess I'm just going back to post-game stuff for now. They take a while to show up again. Alright. Did I get what you need yet? I believe Octillery Inc. has fantastic potential. Oh, I haven't figured out that one yet. It's not done. It's not quite done. Alright, if that's the case, let's go back to the plates then. Head to Moonview Arena. Alright, that's probably Cresselia. Let's get ready for that, then. Don't need to keep Snorlax with me right now. The city is almost done. Pikachu gotta grow up. Hmm. 
You can get, easily get another Decidueye like that, though. It's so funny. Um, Rampardos is cool. I got it from this. I got I got Rampardos or Cranidos from the Space Time Distortion. I guess that makes sense that the fossil Pokemon appear in those because they don't have the technology to revive the fossils, obviously. Um, wondering what's something I can just work on right now. I use Heatran at some point. We got Magnemite. Um, I'm going to Mount Coronet, so I may as well just uh, do that one right quick, why don't I? Glide score there. Actually, you know what I realized? Um, I might for Magnemite and Magneton. I'm gonna need to use their moves eventually, so I should save this because I can catch. I already have Magnezone, so I'll wait on that. It's for Gligar, Onyx. I haven't found Metal Coat yet. Probably from the Merit Point thing eventually. That's an Alpha Stantler. Rhyperior's there. Decisions, decisions. Oh, Alpha Cascoon there. Might as well take that out and evolve it right now. There's my shiny Dust Talks. And my good old Typhlosion boy. Baby Bear. Frostlass. That's a Ralts level 16. Hmm. I already got evolved one of those, pretty sure. Yeah, I did. I had another Porygon right there. That's level 20. You can get a better level on that. Carnivine, Clefairy. There's the Rapidash they give you for free. This thing needs uh, recoil damage to evolve, right? I'll work on that at some point. I'm just trying to have things passively, like, evolving in the background with me, you know what I mean? I'll just grab the magic carp. I, I got nothing else to think of immediately in mind. Yeah, I've gotten Sylveon. Sylveon is in the game. Um, hang on, where's the pebbles and stuff? Can do that. Not that I need it for much longer, though. Palkia, need you around and be able to survive some more. Pokemon I'm training for to max out their moves and stuff. Just want to use this up to keep them going. Yeah, that's enough for now. Alright, oh, I, I took out this to evolve it and I was going to put it back in. Oops. It needs to receive three, 300 recoil damage without fainting. You're talking about Basque Legion? All at once? Or total? What? So you're telling me you have to, like... Not at once? Okay, good. <laughs> oh, I'm fine, you don't worry. I'm stretching slightly. Here, let me just get rid of this uh, dust ox now. Well, this Mount Coronet right away. I got a Sneasel for the Razor Claw from the um, thing. Chat, what how, what's the difference between evolving regular Sneasel and Hisuian Sneasel again? I don't know if they're both Razor Claw still. Evolve this when I get to the Highlands, just because. It's just the time of day. Oh. Because original Sneasel only evolved at night. New one is just at day. Okay, I see. Anyways. Alright, chat. Let's do this. Let's go find Cresselia, I guess. First, let's just evolve Nose Pass, because it's piss easy to do. You just have to be here. That means all the nose pass here can just evolve whenever they feel like it. They need someone in their life to tell them. Tell them they can grow a mustache. And now I gotta get rid of it. There's the bronzer. 
It's not giving me so much to do, game. Uh, if that's the case, honestly, I can evolve to a Sneasler right now. Or I could wait and try and hunt a shiny one. Decisions, decisions. I don't know, take the Shellos and evolve it. I'm, I'm kind of sick of staring at this menu now. Anyway, looks like it's up there. Is there a closer one? Oh, yeah, there literally was. Hang on. Moon Blue Arena. Lost and found. Scrumpo is lost satchel. Is there anything up top of these? Hang on. Spiel. Oh, thank goodness you passed by. Please, I need you to rescue my spiel. Its adorable round body caused it to go rolling down the hill, and it's headed straight for the Stone Tooth Rose and Bolderol Ravine. Those are full of dangerous Pokemon. You're that new Survey Corps member everyone's talking about, right? Please help me find my dear Spiel. Okay, chat. I could go catch the Legendary, but there's a baby seal in danger. I gotta go. I see it. Spee. It's rolling away. How could it? It's rolling away. Save the baby. Spee. Look at it roll, chat. Look at it roll! Hi, Golem. Ow, you can't just roar me. Come back, child. Spin. Whoa. Why do you keep rolling away from me? Oh my goodness, Spiel, I can't believe you rolled all the way down here. You escorted Spiel all the way, right? Thank you so much. Please meet me back at the summit camp. Thank you properly there. Look at that round, friend. It is very round. Excellent. May as well finish off Decidueye right here, the Graveler, then swap it out for, like, Samurott. Oh, it missed. Cool. Lepaberry.
Pop him. Get him. The baby Spiel did just want to roll around. Don't we all just want to roll around, chat? Okay. Wait, what? Strong style move. 40. Okay, so it doesn't have the check mark because I have to report it, I see. So just one more agile style and two more leaf storms in total. Perfect. The city Y is nearly 100% done. Graveler just got booped. Oh, that's a satchel. Hang on. Can evolve. Hey, get that out. Alright, that last hit. Yep. Oh no, uh, sorry, I completely forgot again. I have to catch I have to catch four of them. Which means I need to evolve those rallets. Or find more rallets as well. <clears throat> My mistake. I totally forgot. Anyhow, there's nothing else I can do by using Decidueye anyway. 100% for what I can do. Camp's over here. No, I want to swap. You served me well, little lad. Now we're Samurai. Pretty sure Typhlosion's in the exact same position as Decidueye now. I just need to catch four more. There it is. Hang on. I'm also going to evolve the Magikarp now. <clears throat> Yeah, no, I caught, uh, Rallets from a Distortion here last time. Mm. <coughs> Jeez. Mm. No, stop doing that. So much evolving to do. Uh, Abra's already about to evolve. I don't really need to do that. Just take another Chimchar with me. It doesn't matter. Alright. Now, let me check Samurott's Pokedex. There it was. Alright. Aqua Tail, Hydra Pump, and Strong and Agile Style. I don't need to use Ceaseless Edge, Ceaseless Edge anymore. Still quite a ways to go on that. Agile's almost done, though. That's fine. Focus on Strong. And I think I'll just give it... That mattered much. You know, I'll let Samurott have it all. Why don't I? So it doesn't get beat up in battle too much. Let's 
that's good enough for now. And my inventory got a bit sorted still. Just remove some stuff for now. Okay, good enough. Grab some extra jet balls with what I can make. Alright. Now let's go ahead and save again. I don't suppose a grunt like you would even know, but I guess it behooves me to ask. Do you know about a Pokemon called Cresselia? I do. Well, I figured you'd know. I wouldn't expect any less from someone who managed to defeat me, even if it was just a fluke. Cresselia is said to be the very embodiment of the Crescent Moon. Her feathers are called Lunar Feathers, and legend says that if you hold one as you fall asleep, you'll be visited with wondrous dreams. Well, I call her a nightmare, that pesky Cresselia. She's descended upon Moonview Arena and caused my lord to hide itself away. I'm so worried about Electrode, I can't even sleep. Never mind dream. I think you might be able to catch Cresselia and perhaps even claim one of those lunar feathers. Oh, do catch that pesky flying croissant. Do it for my poor Electrode. Though I suppose Cresselia can't be all bad if she at least recognizes the perfection of the arena looked after with loving care by the great Melly. Alright. So, some people told me that there's a glitch with Cresselia. Some people said that they caught Cresselia and it gave them two. And that's probably been patched because of the update that just went live, but, um... I guess we'll see here. Oh. Oh, my controls are reversed. That's annoying as hell. Alright. Well, that did not work out how I wanted. Yeah, they fixed Cresselia. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna go for Thunder Wave. Cresselia wasn't a giant Pokemon, was it? Looks about right to me. Go for it. I should have used an Ultra Ball. Not a, not a Gigaton Ball. You did it, Pikachu. Congratulations. There was a soft lock here. If you somehow managed to catch Cresselia before talking to Melly. Oh. You obtained the Dread Plate. That's the power to gain dark type. Okay. Well, well, this is unexpected. Instead of a lunar feather, you got some kind of plate. I do feel power emanating from it, though. In any case, if Cresselia did not gift us with any of her feathers, then I suppose she thought we had no need for them. Not bad at all, Grunt. Though I suppose anyone with enough luck to best the great Melly should be able to handle at least that much. Thinking about it, a halfway competent person like you might actually make a decent sparring partner to help my lord and I grow stronger still. I will go back to the settlement and tell the others about the feathers that we didn't get. Cresselia says no good dreams. No one gets to dream of Teddy Ursus and Moomins today. There are two more plates left to find. Okay. Now, I haven't explored here again. because There's probably an unknown because I've seen unknowns in the other arenas hidden around, right? Uh, a tree, maybe? Let me look around. Oh, did I see something there? No, I didn't. 
taking a look around. You can see he's going to climb the tree. Can't see anything up here. Hmm. There was one next. There was an unknown outside of Arcanine's arena, one inside of Cleaver's arena, so. Let's see if I can just find one right here carefully. Maybe in here? Maybe. Hang on. Up in there? No, I don't see. Those, pil those pillars look like an easy way to hide something. Nothing on the tree. Nothing underneath. Some mysterious music for this arena I'm never coming back to. Hmm. Don't see anything. Cannot go further. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me go the other way then. Maybe up top the little arch, maybe? No, I don't see anything right now. I if Ursula finds anything here. Nope. Nothing for you. Alright, let me heal up and swap my team, I guess. Is my team needing any replacements? Oh, Chimchar's ready to evolve after that catch. Perfect. I already looked around the tree. I didn't see it there. Just let me rest for a little while. Okay, so what did the quest say the other ones were at? Quests. Snow Point Temple. Open the door of the lower floors. The plate of pre. Oh, the wait. Defeating Komodo in a battle is how you get the plate? I didn't even realize that. Alright then. Let's go to Snow Point next then. By the time I'm done with that, I, I should be more than strong enough to beat Komodo. Uh. Snow Point. That's an entirely different area I gotta go to. Yeah. Seems you made some new observations. Only 120 points, but that's okay. We need to go to the snow point. Oh? Uh... I'm gonna go to this first, and now, I guess. All right, let's try this. Just one. Nah. This probably get me some levels as well, so let's go for it. Fly, Mr. Fly.
Ponyta. Can't use Ponyta. Can train Samurai. That one's already had me a free shiny though. Thirty-seven. Sixty-two. Okay, Palkia for this one. So good. Pony. Let's see if I can land some hydro pumps. Because they show up at high level, I can get some good training in for the whole team here while I'm doing things. Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Uh, just keep regular using regular hydro pump here. Rough him up. Is anything ready to evolve? Okay, so far so good. I am getting marks for defeating here. Hang on. Am I... Okay, it checks the field. I was wondering what that was for a second. I don't use that much, do I? Listen, maybe the Ponytas shouldn't be swarming during a rainstorm if they didn't want to get hurt. That's all I can say to them. Defeating them with water type moves is a necessary check anyway. Um, I can just use Lepa Berries. What am I worried about? I know you can increase max PP in this game. Not that it's really that needed. It's only the only thing I'd want to increase PP for is just like us make it makes training uh like five PP moves slightly uh, more convenient. That's all. Why is it Ponyta's fault? Well, the game spawned it. So the game has to deal with it. <laughs> Alright. Going to swarms like this is a good way to fill out your decks, whether you're catching or battling things. Uh, let me get one of these in. Maybe I'll find something I can use Thunderbolt with Porygon 2 on. Hmm. Bovin Basculation is good for um, use, using Lepa Berries. Resting resets the recoil counter, I think. Is that how it works? Did the breakout go away? Oh, I see. The more of these I, I go to... So I can go to three of them and then the storm disappears. So if I find a Pokemon I don't like, I can go to a different one without risking the storm going away then. Is that how it works? Interesting. Kind of like this. That's hot. There's an alpha one there.
Electric moves. Perfect for uh, Pikachu and Porygon. What level are they? 61? Oh. Okay. Don't have... Oh, right. Play rough. Okay, you missed. He missed, chat. Don't worry. He missed. I win. Resting doesn't reset the Rayquaza counter. Okay. And there you go. Was hoping I could do this. Let me see if I can win. Kill it with a uh, Thunderbolt now. Wait, 77? I thought it. I thought it was 60. Seven. Well, I'm going, I'm, going, I'm going for it. Yeah, you did it, Porygon. Good. Once again, Pikachu just dies. Alright, let's go to a different one. I, I dealt with the Alpha. Have some berries, Pikachu. I know it's the Alpha, but I, I thought I checked its level, and it was lower. Okay. Get this one. Pikachu does not have good defenses, I know. I thought maybe one strong Thunderbolt would kill, though. Abra's again. Let's see. It is Abra's. Yeah, it's Abra's. Okay. Let's go over here. Have I checked this spot before? Hey, Starlies! Whoopee! Alright, let's try this one. I haven't seen any Wisp. Is that... I thought... Okay, it's Krikatot. I thought I saw a Flareon for a second. I'm like, that's not right. You, it, you, If you, like, squint your eyes... <gasps> Round friends, chat! Look. Look at that. Look at that. Number of specimens. Seen it use rollout. Scared. I had to do it, chat. Number defeated. I have to kill 25 seals? No! Oopsie. Look at the wholesome creatures roll. So does anyone know, um, with these new massive swarms, are you able to save scum them like the others? Is that a Celio? Wait, what? Did a Celio just spawn inside that spiel? It did, didn't it? You can't save spawn the older anymore. So they patched out the ability to save scum the, the swarms now. Uh oh. That's not a great camera angle there. So, the, what, what did they do to change how they work that you can't save scum them anymore? Let Pikachu fight here. Yep, they. Alright. All right, then. Guess you can't do that anymore, chat. Shallows can evolve. For science. I hate doing this little round seal friends, chat, but they have to be defeated. 
Science demands it. All right. Am I doing wrong thing? So essentially, you just you can only really save and load to uh, check which like um all the question marks are de are determined, right? Can you save scum that? Like, if you know you want to focus on one specific spot, if you save and reload, it will still be it will still be the same species each time. Alright. Number caught. Let's go here. Yeah, same species, okay. Oh, hi, guys. Hi. Whoa. They're angry now. Monkeys. I don't think these have a a check for being defeated though, do they? Let's do it. You're fine, Samurai. You're fine. Wait, I caught the Infernape, didn't I? Uh oh. Hang on, this should be fine. Let's heal you. Can use a Lepa Berry on that. Any bait here? Damn it. Let's fight this one. Oh, it broke out over there, didn't it? Okay. As a metal form, can Monferno even really have much? Hang on. I'll check here. Oh, give them food? I should be doing that, yeah. Uh, okay. Number caught. Easy enough to do that. Just flame wheel and flamethrower. That's an annoying thing I'll have to do on my own. Hang on.
least I'm filling things out. Did I really just hit that one? How did I do that? Rainstorm seems like it's gonna clear up. Okay, it's based on time, not amount taken care of here. I didn't mean to press that. I meant to go into strong moves. I should have went for Aqua Tail or Hydro Pump. I don't know why I hit, keep hitting Water Pulse. A new horde seems to have formed. Uh oh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. That's a tiny Infernape. I need that. Tight moves. Oh, damn it. Okay, then. Get up, you. Alright, let's go, then. Yeah. Not so tough now, are ya? Regular Aqua Tail should be fine. Um, I don't know if I could kill them with Earth Power. That's the issue. At least seeing them use Flare Blitz is going to give me checks for it. I have to defeat them specifically with with uh, ground type moves, but I don't really have a mod. I'm training for that right now. Um, I guess I could get strong style checks by doing this. Let's do that. I don't know about this new horde uh, being able to be a thing. Luckily, I don't seem to have options here. I'm guessing the wild AI looks this, is the same as uh, vanilla games, where it's just a randomly selected move with no no AI to it. Yeah, I'm trying to perfect the decks for this. This is the kind of game where I feel like it'd be fun to just 100%, and I want to keep playing tons of it on stream. All right. Oh. Rainstorm ended. Swarm of Infernape here is kind of unexpected. can evolve this when I'm pretty sure I don't need a cot check anymore. Draw all that catching Monferno and Infernape, and uh, I was able to evolve my own Monferno, but I don't think I need to anymore. Does form in a new horde increase the shiny odds again? I'm not sure how it works. Anyhow. Oh, that's the grass rock. I haven't gotten leafy on yet. B. I used up a lot of jet balls there. Can I grab some more stone while running around? Um. Hmm. I could go for the lost satchels right now. I do need to get more, um. I do need to get more of that stuff going too.
I want to be able to get... Oh! Alright, I guess I gotta do that now before I leave. That's Alpha Shellos. I want the merit points so I can, um... Buy the evolution items I need for some mons I'm missing. A palm. Prosperity. Okay, it's over there. Chat, count me down five minutes. Let me know when it's about to start. Somebody, maybe. Oh. This is an accident, but I'll take it. Ball of mud. Wow, I can't believe that was in the ground. Ayo. Anything else I'm gonna grab there? Can't beat you. Find something to use Thunderbolt with Porygon with. Uh, hang on. Do I have recovery yet on Porygon? I do, okay. I need to use those moves a ton of times. Grab a bunch of materials. Hmm. Constantly distracted by everything in this damn game. the Snorlax. Honey. Just YOLO at once and move on. Haha, <laughs> I got it. I'm using up so many jet balls, though. When was the next plate I was gonna go to? Right, Snowpo Snowpoint Temple, but I got distracted with the massive mass swarms. Well, that was an absolute waste. I didn't mean to throw that. Hang on. That's gonna start soon, so better get into position. Resting now resets the space-time distortion, right? So I don't want to do that. About two minutes left. The tumblestone. Where are those? Starly. All right, here it goes. A little sooner than I thought. Let's go grab some friends, chat. Better use the Ultra Balls for this. Stardust, Red Shard. Haunter. Oh, regular Sneasel. Only way to get more of them. I only have just the one. Hmm. There's, there's an Eevee here as well. Great. Better do this to get rid of you. Tongue is a little brat. Oh, that's not good. 
All right, then. If that's the case, I'm just going to YOLO it for the Sneasel. I don't remember if the Sneasel I caught was a guy, but now I got this one. Hmm. No combat on you. I don't need to finish the battle there. Let me revive now. Revive and, um... Use my last potion on Palkia. Alright then. I guess I gotta haunt her instead! <laughs> Caught at night, chat. <laughs> All right. Onyx, Ursa Ring. That's a big Ursa Bear. Not the bear I need, though. Where's the cool bear? Hi, Evie. Ursa Teddy is best Teddy. Oh. oh, don't be like that, you little brat. Hmm. Oh, Eevee's in the battle? Why? I tried to aim at an Eevee in the distance, and then as soon as I threw the ball, they, like, despawned, and, uh, a Haunter popped in front of me. Imagine if that happened, but it was, like, a shiny or something. That would be an amazing clip. Okay. Let's do this. Excellent. May as well beat up the Eevee with this. I gotta fix my headphones, chat. Hang on. Oof. This is such a really nice game to relax to. I say that a lot, but damn. Play an attorney of this. Yeah, it's already been like two hours. Last time I played this, I ended up going for like, for like four hours. I'm probably gonna do that again. At least over three hours, I, I think. But I've like streamed all weekend, so I'm, after today, I'm probably just gonna take a few days. Okay. Take a few days, hang on, let's fight this. I wanted to get back to right, uh, right where, uh, right in the video I was working on. Hang on, let me do this. Regular Hydro Pump's fine. Plus, um, I was going to have Dylan over for Toho on Wednesday, but... Uh-oh, okay, that's fine. We're fine. But Wednesday is actually also Dylan's stream anniversary, so uh, he's probably got his own plans. So we'll have to do that another time. Big Ursa Teddy. Take out the ring bear. Hmm. Spatial random. Well, that's something. Alright. Wish I had brought in different Pokemon for this, but it's too late now. Got some stuff, at least. I can't believe that one didn't see me. Don't ask how that happened. I didn't catch it, though. Big Ursa Bears. I need to take, like, the mark off there. Oh, Steelix!
haven't even seen that yet. Hmm. Let's focus on the other ones first. Eevee learned what? No, he didn't. Well, he's in a distortion, so it's not the most unfitting thing, I suppose. Should kill it, I hope. That little Eevee gotta die. Of course it missed. Well, at least that did too. No! Don't do that. Catching the Steelix will save me having to buy a metal coat later. I just want to kill the other Pokemon first, but I keep missing. I gotta get my item checks anyway, so it's alright. Or, uh, move checks. Hey. Alright, new one obtained. Time seeing you spatial rend. Like a tongues. Can anything special come from the trees while you're like this? No, nope, guess they're they're the same. Level 11. Yeah, may as well just get a free check from this. What was that noise? Like a tongue. Toxicroak. High Haunter. Don't need to worry much about them. Alright, same deal. Oh. Well, oh well. Don't care. Hi, Leafeon. Leafeon looks excited. I'm just gonna YOLO uh, the ball on Leafeon. It's on it already. Because I seem to be getting getting away with that, so let's see if uh, this works. Wow, I got away with it. Pop it. I haven't evolved an Eevee into Leafeon yet, so that works out. There goes that. Let's see if Samurai can just finish it. It's raining, so I want to say Strong Style Hydro Pump would work. Oh, it's empty. Well, Strong Style Aqua Tail would work. Most. Oh, I'm dead. I I know how to play the game, friend. There we go. 
Strong style. Kill it, Pikachu. Prove yourself for once. Hey! And it looks like that's it. Hi, Krikatoon. Everyone's fainted. Anything special here? Hmm. I haven't seen another wisp around here. I think there was like only a couple left. Maybe they're down the islands again. Now it's daytime. Magikarp. Oh, I may as well pop in and take a look. Wait, what's that noise? Oh, is that an alpha carp? Hang on. Alright then. How hard can it be? Get in there, Pikachu. 55! Okay. Oh no, chat. What am I gonna do? Oh, it avoided the attack. Oh no, it's filling up my, my Pokedex check for Magikarp. Just use up Gigaton Ball. Fix my seat here, chat. There we go. That's it, you caught it. Uh, which direction was I going? Actually, I don't remember now. I think it was this way. Obsidian Falls. Wasn't there a guy who wanted me to do something in Orber Tunnel? Yeah, I may as well do that request while I'm here. Getting distracted 10,000 times playing this game, but it's okay. Can I really not do anything at the waterfall? Nope. Be funny, though. Wait, who's this guy? Nope. Oh my god, just get off the thing. You made a choice just now, didn't you? You chose to talk to me. I have something in my right hand and something in my left. I think you would like either. Choose left or right. Then I will give you the item in that hand. Uh, right? So you chose the right. In my right hand, I have a red shard. Here, take it. Wow, I didn't just pick up, like, ten of these. Can't tell you what was in the hand you didn't choose. That's a secret. Just think about it. It's impossible to know what lies down the path you didn't take. And this is the same. A simple choice of right or left could change the future. It's said that our life experience is constructed but by the sum of all the choices we make. I hope you will make great choices that lead you to a never better future. That's a whole lot of words for giving me garbage. All that, all that talk and he gave me a red shard, that's literally it? That's a little bit lame and wasted. No wisp. Warren Bridge. Nothing under here, is there? I don't think there's any wisp just out in the water. Checking for unknowns or any that. Peaceful. Peaceful like a movement over here. The other hand was probably a blue shard or something. I guarantee you that. Anything else I can grab around while I'm running around this place? No! Where's Weird Ear? 
thing. Horseshoe planes. That's a beaver. And that's Rapidash again. Um, there's nothing in the water here. Hang on, I should go back to camp and swap out my team, then go to, uh, Orboro Tunnel. That's what it's called. Okay. First, let me just rest. Hmm. All this stuff here. I may as well evolve the Alpha Carp. Leafeon is just Leafeon. Nothing too special about that. I may as well get Weavile. Or wait, no, it's daytime. Uh, I think I'll just stock up on the shards, or claws, sorry, until I'm ready to figure out what I want to do with Sneasel. Everything needs to be done all at once. A regular Gyarados there. Electabuzz. An Alpha Electabuzz. Hmm. I was training Affinion for something, but I evolved one into Luminion, didn't I? Let me go to earlier ones here. As well, maybe Ursatetti. Another baby Gibble. Hmm. Wow, I can't really think what I want to do right now. There's regular Sneasel I caught before. Another damn Chansey. Another Magikarp there. Take this, Shellos. Why don't I? Now then, let me just get a check for more Gyarados and an Alpha one. Gyarados got an idea for a new move. Sure as heck better have. Okay, is there an Alpha Gyarados check? Number you've evolved. Looks like you gotta evolve a lot of them. Okay, not an Alpha Specimen one for that. Shatot doesn't evolve. No reason to carry that stupid thing around. <laughs> Another Shellos here. Meow, Glammeow. I could just evolve another Teddy, but then I lose a bear in the process, and that's just unbearable. Eh, take a Paris. Why not? The level up enough over time. Okay, now what was I gonna do? Head towards Orboro Tunnel. Let's go to the Grand Tree Arena. Here's that cowboy, mister. See. I didn't bring any friendship mons with me, did I? That's fine. I need to get some Thunderbolt checks for uh, Porygon as well, anyway. Seeing it use Gust. You can also just let these things hit me. Bear puns, that's right. I mean, I kind of have to take damage before I can do that, though, can I? that? Something like pick up? Oh, a Sneasler prompt. Definitely not what I needed there. Don't need to deal with the baby bumblebees, that's for sure. I can leave them alone, actually. Didn't want to do that.
Candy truffle. That's a funny bunny right there. Let me check out the tunnel. Now, where's the dude at? The other side, maybe? Alpha Onyx. Oh. S excuse me? Wait, is that the quest? Oh, it's the quest Pokemon. Okay, oh, cool. All right, just wasted Pokeballs for nothing. <laughs> oh, good, you made it. Those glowing red eyes, it's one of those alpha things, right? It rages about so much, I'm afraid it might bring the whole tunnel down. It's really dangerous. Defeat the raging Pokemon. Alright. Grok. Break it down. Level 60. Okay. Destroy it. All right, works for me. Wow, you're as good as they say. And that Alpha Onyx has calmed right down. Huh, half expected to get right back to thrashing about. Oh, yeah? Call it a feeling, but maybe you weren't raging at all, but actually just trying to dig a tunnel? If that's the case, we may as well dig together. That's settled then. From now on, we're a team. Guess you could say that Onyx and I are on it. Now I've got a partner that's more than dependable, and it's all thanks to you. It's not much, but please take this grit rock as a, pro a token of my appreciation. A bunch of iron chunks, too. I'll take it. There are some folks who are saying they'd make statues of Pokemon if we find some quality stone. And Leon of the Pearl Clan said we might even find coal here. Are they making... Is that supposed to be a nod to the statues you can find in BDSP's underground? I don't know. Okay, partner, let's see which one of us can dig more. On. Alright, then. Guess there's no way for me to catch that one. Oh, hello, Machop. How are you today? Defeat with flying-type moves. Also, chat, do you hear any background noise? Um, it's snowy outside, so people in the neighborhood are just, like, uh, shoveling the, their, like, walkways right now. Not much I can really do about that. I'll take a couple minutes. Line type moves. I don't have that on me. Heavy specimens. Defeat. I don't need to... I, when I need to train a flying type, I need to remember to come here and beat up a bunch of machops. Okay, don't hear it? Alright, Good. We keep having, like, we keep having constant, like, clear days, and then just a, a bunch of snow, and we gotta all shovel it. It's annoying. Let's get some stone here. Now, I didn't see, like, an unknown or something here. Don't hear it? Alright, good. Y'all could send you could hear it last time. Oh, didn't want to do that. I don't think I can get what it, it's probably like above me or something. I don't know. Or outside. It's gotta be. Just climb up. Oh, Blissey. Alpha Blissey. Yeah, it's here. Oh, I found it. Hey, did you do you mind?
Old verse 15. Or a series of poems. I think I'll read it now. The flow of time never stops. The past, future, and present. Space is ever expanding dimensions. Our spirits, too, is a, are as ever space. Rude, Blissey. Strong style move, double edge. Kill with fighting move. I'm gonna just kill it with Aqua Tail. Cause I need to use my physical move anyway, so. And I just want to get uh, a chunk of experience would be nice right now too. What is Blissey's problem? I don't know. This was like those evil bliss, evil chances we see in uh, Pokemon Fool's Gold. Or they're just like little devils. EXP Pinata. Ooh, that's a lot. Blue shellos can evolve. Oh, so can Paris. Look at that, chat. More friends. We must be... Defeat with psychic moves. Okay. Don't have that being worked on right now. All right. I've been getting some side quests done, been checking out some stuff. Man. For how much fun this game is, for like how repetitive it, 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 it kind of is, like it's just fun to do things. Imagine how much more fun it'd be if, like, the quests weren't, like, the most basic, simple things you've ever seen. There we go. Oh, what's that? Wanda, the disappear character, has disappeared again. Go find her. Oh, you found her? Okay, do it again. Oh, you found her again? Oh, do it again. What's that? You found a mysterious stranger in the middle of the ocean? Here's a red shard. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I forgot to evolve the Paris. Let me do that in a second. That kind of reminds me is like, um... Like when I'm grinding, like, trophies in games. I hate when, um, a lot of the trophies are something along the lines of, like, do the same thing over and over and over. <laughs> yeah. Like, one I'm about to get another Platinum for was, uh... Well, one I also recently Platinum. Like, I got... I Platinum Bloodborne. And... Oh, Chansey. Hang on. And... Bloodborne was really fun. Like, 99% of the way through. But then those stupid Chalice Dungeons just... Were so annoying to play. Oh, uh, okay. I hit the machop, machop, so I'll take it. Uh, the chalice dungeons were really, really boring and repetitive, and I did not like them. Made grinding that final trophy an absolute slog. Another one I'm almost finished is, like, Resident Evil Revelations 2. That one I've been, I've been working on on and off for, like, a year, because it's just, like, replay the damn... It's like replay the same thing over and over and over, and I don't. I, at this point, I'm I'm so close. It's like I need to finish it off. I got one of the harder ones done last night. Oops. I don't actually know how Elden Ring is like, cause recently when I for like platinum trophies, before Bloodborne it was Demon the Demon Souls remake. I didn't really like how slow Demon Souls was, but I like how fast Bloodborne is. I don't I don't really want to play Elden Ring unless I know uh if it falls more towards Bloodborne than Demon Souls. Okay. Oh, 
thought that was a Pokemon for a second there. Any more things I can grab? I could run around the forest like a chump again. Listen to the wholesome music. It's more Bloodborne? Okay, good. I'm not in a big rush to play that game. I'm not even sure that's the kind of game I'd want to, like, stream for the fir as a first playthrough. I'd probably, like, play it on my own first. It's an Alpha Cypher. Now, the question is, is there a requirement for Alpha Cleaver? Better check that, actually. Cleaver, Cleaver. Uh, Cleaver was with a K in this game, right? Or was it C? I'm losing my mind. Okay. No, it doesn't matter. What about Scizor? I wonder if there's anything along this over here. Oh, I guess not. Guess it's a dead end. Okay. Hear a noise. The heartwood. I am still gathering stuff. What's that? Damn it. Damn it! How did he see me? I have not even played a dark like played Dark Souls really. There we go. Hmm. I haven't checked down by the beach for a bit. Just the barrel. There. Where is it? Found it. Ball of mud. Thank you, game. That's unfortunately pretty useless. Gold bat. Half the cricketoon. Oh, there's one of the wisp I was looking for. Really, I'm just gonna find it by wandering. There's one more. Alpha taut. What am I looking for here? Hmm. Near the arena now. May as well get a hydro pump check off this. I also need to see things pop out. Can you say overkill? Because this Geodude's gonna drown. Just keep wandering. I was supposed to go to Snow Point Temple like an hour ago. <laughs> Yet here we are again, chat. Hang on. Ghost type moves. Caught at night, defeated. Can do that anytime. I still haven't found yet like another shiny yet. Hmm. I wonder if I can do a quick look for that last wisp. Where am I at now, anyway? Oh, damn, I've gone all the way back here, haven't I? Where 
Wherever the wisps may be. Uh, what about this tall building here? Uh, building? <laughs> oh, come on. You can't just... I was about to leave. You can't do that to me. Chat. I have to go to the space-time distortion. Where's it at? Uh... Oh, here. What could pop out from that one? Great. Should've just turned around and looked. <sighs> Can't just do that to me. It's legal. I was I was really about to go back so I can go to Snow Point, but now I gotta check that distortion. Hang on. I'm just picking up materials so I can craft more balls when I get back. I may as well swap up my mons right quick while I'm at, at a camp. Is that my again? Uh-oh. Thank you for your investigation in the Obsidian Fieldlands. Am I gonna lose the space-time distortion now? Oh, okay. Well, I got a lot of chunks from that, didn't I? Did you learn anything about the massive swarms? They come in rainstorms. Could that mean, do Pokemon gather when there's especially heavy rain? I wonder whether Munchlax was reacting to the rainstorm or the massive mass swarm itself. Well, we'll just have to investigate further, but how did best to do so? We've had a good look around Obsidian Fieldlands, but it's only raised more questions. That frown doesn't suit you at all. Oh, Mistress Calibre. Well, you see... Mass outbreaks that occur during rainstorms. I've never heard of such a thing. But of course, life is full of surprises. After all, it's not often that Pokémon from beyond our world appear at the Temple of Sinnoh, either. Perhaps these Pokémon are reacting to the arrival of Mighty Palkia. Why don't we head back to Jubilee Village? A razor's shop may be a good place to visit. That girl's place is awfully, awfully popular at all, after all. And where people gather, information abounds. Of course, the hairdressers. Good thinking. Why are we going there? If anyone there has seen one of these massive swarms, they might be willing to share deets with us. It's settled then. I'll wait for you at the hairdressers. Alright. Is it still... Okay, it's still happening. Okay, Gastrodon is done. I'll just catch an Alpha Squirrel for that one quest at some point. I gotta evolve a Psyduck. That's a male combi. Pasture 2. There's my shiny. Baby Teddy. That's a little Raichu. A Stunky. I guess I could take this with me for now. What about this one? Okay, it's a weaker one. This should be good. All right, let me craft now. Jet balls. A whole four of them. Whoopee. Make 35 ultra balls, though. Just make some more of those for now. What about max potions? Just the one. Two revives. Can't make sticky globs. Got a Dawnstone. Thunderstone. A rock there. Beans, chat. Beans. The mushroom. Running low on stuff. Alright then, let's head towards the space-time continuum. Distortion. Shinx is down there. No shiny Shinx, though. Kind of want to see the little orange ones again. They're cute. Shiny Luxray is a good one.
13 Jet Balls, 35 Ultra Balls. Alright, let's get settled here, chat. May as well gra gather some materials. I need more Sky Stones so I can make more Jet Balls, though. That's the issue. Still great soundtrack for this. But it's distorted in the distortion, as you can hear. Can I find bear bear stuff here? Where'd it go? Oh, another poem. Oh, who cares about the poem? Would you like to read it now? Sure. The field ends rush by under hoof as Weird Ear carries me astride. Companions of mine run alongside us. Pokemon Dash. I said that wrong. We come to stand where wind had swept and old days play before my eyes. The memories come running through, linking this place to times gone by. Space, time and space here blend together and enfold my heart as I remember. Uh, Snorlax over there. Snorlax just hanging out, doing his thing. Alright, here we go. It's starting. What? Waterstone. Dawnstone. Licky licky. Give me some of that. Sneasel. Oh, come on. Haunter. That's nothing. Where's the items at? Oh, no, you don't. There's Sneasel again. A lot of items down here. Oopsie. Can I find just like a metal coat or something in here? That'd be nice. Or Razor Claw. Stardust. I really gotta get around to selling all the money stuff I've been collecting and hoarding for a while, huh? Another Sneasel. Uh, I have to defeat this enough times to. I gotta give it food. Hmm. So they, the uh, Hisuian Sneasel and regular Sneasel count together. So I can just farm Hisuian one. I don't have to worry too much about doing this. Take a look over here. I haven't seen a shiny inside of one of these yet. I just know that I'm gonna go in like pure panic mode when that happens. Because I'm gonna be scared I'm gonna lose it. Because <laughs> I'm surrounded by Pokemon. You have to fight them. Oh, hang on. Is that Alpha Sylveon? That was unexpected. Level 80. Okay. Me running up to it with my, uh, legendary dragon. Uh-oh. I don't need this, but... Well, I guess I have it now. Well, there's certainly one I can train. Alright, listen here, you little piece of garbage. Think you can just rough me up? You know who I am? 
Why did I send a dragon against the fairy? Or my other train mon is dark type, so... What, what are you saying? I... I caught it. I'm the winner here, Mina. Don't you criticize me. Let me see. I'm gonna use this potion here. That's just a licky licky. What is this thing? Stun it using items? Eh, sure, I don't like it. Okay. Looks like he didn't like me either. Any more items on the ground? Oh, hi, regular Sylveon. Sneasel. Okay. Just a bunch of normal looking friends, don't worry. Might as well defeat it while well, it's by itself. Let me get my strong style checks in. There we go. I haven't really been able to. Oh, it's Angry Mama Bear. I do not need to fight Angry Mama Bear. Leafeon again. Already caught one earlier. And looks like it's ending. Alright, that one was a good haul. Now I should uh, get out of here before I distract myself for the 10,000th time. See, you caught 26 Pokemon. I've been busy, okay? I like catching Pokemon. It's a lot of money. Buy a whole inventory slot with that. This pure-hearted Pokemon shares its eggs with the injured. These eggs are so nutritious, they've been nicknamed Doctor's Doubles. This Pokemon shares roots with the Sneasel of Hisui, but unlike that species, that this one is spiteful in personality. I hypothesize that the water and earth can affect Sneasel's mind and body. Its sturdy curved claws are ideal for traversing precip precipitous cliffs. From the tips of these claws drips a venom that infiltrates the nerves of any prey caught in Sneasel's grasp. Okay. Still weird to me how, like, uh... The Sneasel that, that's, like, white and blends in in the snowy areas isn't ice-type anymore. Alright. Let's return to the village. I guess I should talk to them over there and see what this goes. Oh, Asprey, Mr. Scalibur's waiting for you. Come on in! Heard all about those massive mass swarms. Bet there's some kind of, uh, there's some sort of Pokemon festival. It's like what I heard from a customer who came here from Johto. Apparently on nights with a full moon, Clefairy get together and dance. It's basically a gathering of Pokemon that only happens when certain conditions are met. Sounds pretty similar to a massive mass swarm, don't you think? So massive mass swarms could be a festival for Pokemon to enjoy the rainstorms. You really think so? 
So, it seems to me you're still biting your tongue, Arizu. Have you heard anything else? Well, I did hear something weird from a Diamond Clan friend of mine. They said they saw a mass swarm of alphas in the Crimson Mirelands. Seriously, do alphas even gather in groups? My friend must have made a mistake, right? Alpha's grouping together. Oh no. Are we gonna go to AlphaCon 2021 chat? Are we gonna see all those guys telling us about how to how to do that grind set? Part of it sounds dangerous, yes it does. Mun. Even the Lady of the Ridge would be no match for a mass uh, swarm of alphas. It's natural to worry about the unknown. That's why Asprey's investigating this for us, no? To put our concerns to rest. You're right, it seems our next step is to investigate the Crimson Mirelands. Alright, maybe we should go do that next. I mean, I caught Cresselia. I'm not in a huge rush to just capture all the, the post-game legendaries. Yeah, sure, let's go. Kinda wanna see this new update stuff more. I can do it I can do anything in this game whenever. Excellent. Let's be off to the Myerlands camp for some massive mass swarm research. Oh no. I feel like just a swarm of alpha Pokemon is the most memeable thing ever. Seems a massive mass swarm has sprung up here in Crimson Mirelands. Let's try and determine if this phenomenon occurs here as it does in Obsidian. Hey ho, little people. No need to fret. Melly has arrived. What do you want? I heard rumors you've been investigating mass swarms or something. But I, Melly, have already solved the mystery. All that remains is to gather evidence. Wow. Not bad, Melly. The reason these Pokemon have been mysteriously gathering in rainstorms is... is... to give praise to the great Melly, naturally. Munchlax is just like, oh boy. Mm, yeah, no, no. Don't look so sour, you two. I realize it's a difficult truth to accept right away, but the awe I inspire is both sun and shadow to Adam and is clearly apparent to Pokemon. And as thanks to your adorable efforts in proving my theory true, I'll give you this generous reward. Go on, take them. They're a guav berries. A rarity here in Hisui, you know. Restoring to each well, Pokemon that hates bitter flavors, each one of these, it will briefly pause. As for why these Pokemon gather during rainstorms, well, that's surely to represent how I'm simply overflowing with wonderful qualities. And with that nugget of wisdom, I shall be off. He was very shy and withdrawn as a child until one day when he announced he was going to work hard to help Adamant. I was happy to see him grow with op uh, grow more optimistic, but I fear he may have taken that to extremes. But a guav berries, where, where could he have found them? Munchlax, did you just eat some of those berries? Munchlax gobbled up five of the aguav berries. Wow. Munch, munch. What's this? Your fancy map is responding to Munchlax again. Alright. Some of them have berries there, too. Map shows not only a brick locations, Pokemon as well. What does this mean, Munchlax? Mun. Uh, go on, go on. You can give a guav berries to Mize Munchlax to find out what Pokemon are appearing at each outbreak location. Alright, sure. Pokemon icons that sparkle, the mark locations are special, while those berry indicate mass outbreaks, you may be able to receive a guav berries. Be sure to make the most of these to help with your investigations. Okay. So if we keep feeding Munchlax a guav berries, we'll be able to learn more about the swarms. Sure, I'll buy it. Munchlax, what is it exactly you're trying to get us to understand? Whatever this all means, please investigate these 
There are three of these locations in the Crimson Mirelands, so we can compare these to the ones we found in Obsidian. Alright, what do we have here, chat? Turtwig? Uh, we're definitely going to that one. So, is she just going to be at every camp, I guess? Uh, hang on, what does this schmuck want? Hey there, could you lend me a hand? I was on my way here from the Mirelands camp when this Alpha Hippowdon came after me. Got away, but I dropped a charm I was carrying. Now I can't find it anywhere, I just gotta have it back. Find a char blade to the swap. Bring it back to me. Pardon me, that was like a yawn that snuck up on me. Well... I'm talking about Sid Widow, of course. I've been waiting for you, kiddo. Let's get down to business and have a look at Sid Widow. It was looking pretty listless, so I gave it a whole feast of berries. But even though it gobbled them up, it still seems like it has no energy. Isn't that odd? So I figured it must be parched. After all, it's like a plant, right? It needs to be watered. So if we could just fire off a healthy water pulse at it, I'm sure it'd perk up in no time. Duh. What? You don't agree? But plants love water. Bring me a Pokemon that can use water pulse and we can get Soda Widow feeling right as rain. Well, I guess I can do that right now. Did you know what I ask? Oh, it looks like the Psyduck had it too. All right, get ready, Soto Widow. All your worries are about to be washed away for good. Oh, I guess we're doing this. Wait, would you? No, do. Go, Palkia. Oh, don't worry. I'll make it feel even better. Yeah. Woo. Maybe it doesn't like getting wet? Do. Is that it? Gosh, I guess I rained on your parade. Sorry, Cinna Widow. And I'm sorry for making you a part of this, too. I thought I was helping. When you get right down to it, I just didn't understand Cinna Widow. Keep working hard on that Pokedex to educate poor fools like me, would ya? Hey, he gave me heavy balls. But they're kind of worthless to me right now. This was such an early quest here. At least I got it done. Um, right, I was going to Turtwig. Guess I can save. Uh, hang on. I gotta check Pikachu right quick here. I wish that there was a thing that shows you, like, a percentage of, like, how close you are to perfecting the Pokedex. That'd be nice, too. Um going too far here. Where is Turtwig? Uh, what am I doing? Number you evolved. I gotta catch ten. Catch without being spotted. See it use leafage. I gotta feed them. Alright, you can do that. Pikachu, Pikachu, Pikachu. Thunderbolt, Thundershock. Thunderbolt needs to be used way more. Come without being spotted. Defeat. So I just gotta keep spamming Thundershock and Thunderbolt with this Pikachu. Um, you know what I could do? Hang on, where's that Grit Dust? Since I'm apparently going to be using this Pikachu for a while. Let's just buff, uh, everything we can here. You know what's weird, chat, when you think about it? When you think of, like, uh, what Pokemon uses for a Mimic, right? In terms of, like, RPG speak. You think of, like, Voltorb in a, in a like, the Fungus family, right? But... Why isn't Sudowoodo considered the Mimic? I mean, it literally learns the move Mimic. you think it would be more closely associated with that, wouldn't it?
These uh, effort items just keep piling in, so I guess I may as well just spam them on Pokemon I'm, I have to use uh, moves on, because Pikachu keeps dying otherwise. No, you can't use Pikachu, bro. Pikachu's cringe. I'm gonna use these now. Okay, that's good enough. Nothing's ready to evolve. I got EXP Candy S. May as well use it up. There you go. Um... I should probably store my inventory. Hang on. I got. I realize I still have a bunch of those shards on me. Let me see if I can craft more jet balls too. Which I doubt though. Oh, I feel a sneeze coming. Oh. Oh, I can make more globs. Hang on. I can make one. Four of those. One of those. Revives. I didn't mean to make twenty-six of them, but now I have. All right. Hang on, how many can I make of these? Okay, I want to save some for Sky Stones. Just put five there for now. Okay. Heavy Balls, don't need those. There's the Aguave Berries. Do I have to keep them on, on hand? Probably. Firestone. Yeah, that's good. Alright, what was I doing? Right. Let's go to the Turtwig already. How about that? Hmm. Well, I mean, Mime Jr. evolves by Mimic because, um, it's literally a, evolves into a Mime. Oh, that's an Alpha Hippo. And it may or may not be mine now. Did not catch. Why am I going this way? I see this sparkly in the distance, though. Uh, hang on. There's two back-to-back -back satchels there. Be like, right behind me. I should probably get those. Wait, no. That's where, uh... That is, huh? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it was in the grass. Wow. I was just randomly mashing there. I can't believe I actually got it. Okay, a little bit to the right. I'll just go to my destination now, it's fine. Hang anyway, on, what's that? Oh, that's Golduck. Hmm. I've heard no sparkly noises, so I've passed no shiny hippos. That's a. Uh, hang on. I need these. No, I, that's not what I wanted. I wanted a caster fern. Skystone is over there. Okay, Turtwig is coming right up, chat. Pick it up. Turtwigs! There's a Grodel. No! Let me just take this one out. Oh, 
hello, friends. Welcome to the stream. Let me just get these out. Don't need to worry about catching Grodel. Um, I gotta throw some food at these lads. There you go. No! Don't run. No! I'm terrible stealth. Number caught. Anymore. That one plopped out. Will a new horde come? Okay. Looks like that's all I'm getting from those. Whatever. I'm about to run out of jet balls now. That's progress on Churchwig anyway. If I can get it to level... Oh, I can't fight this Pikachu. Why did I use Pikachu for that? Better use something more strong. Like Samurott, for crying out loud. Lop him. There's no way I got Churchwig level 10 now. Eh, maybe after I report it. Or does it show the current level or the level it will be? Go. Don't need that kind of crap. Next one. I probably should get berries from one of them. Right on seems like a good thing to get, though. Let's go there. No, there's nothing along the way, right? I mean, there is one bag I can grab. Which reminds me, I keep forgetting to actually check the tab for this. How does it calculate the amount of merit points? Is it like the items that were dropped? Probably. 70. I could probably grab a whole whopping one evolution item after all that. duck. That's... No, that's crow gunk. I thought that was a tiny gold duck for a second. I was very confused. I don't know how he didn't see me. Whatever. About to clear up. Looks like I took too long. I need to see the ride on before it's too late. Parasect. What? What do you mean I can't go that way? Wait, what? Was I not? <laughs> I was going towards the... I was going towards the, uh... I wasn't going towards the flag I set, for some reason. I was going towards the damn, uh... Side mission thing. I blanked on that. Oh, well. Better follow him now. What 
Well, I missed the ride on then, didn't I? Well, that's annoying. Like, I... Ugh, just a few seconds too late, literally. Well, I guess I might as well grab that. I want Skystone. Junior just got spit on right in its face. Wait, is that a wisp? Hang on. Wow, that one did not want to spawn until it was like right in my face, apparently. Six wisps remain in the area. Directly to my right. Down here, I guess? Or is that it over there? Alright, perfect. Alpha Squirrel. No, you didn't see me. I said you didn't see me, bro. Get over here. It's level 40. I'm gonna YOLO ball it. I need an Alpha Squirrel because there's a dude who specifically wants to battle you with, uh, with Pachirisu only. Okay, that works for me. Hang on, what is your dex thing anyway? Use spark, giving it food, leap out of trees, forms I've obtained, investigate strategies. That's what that quest is. Caught while sleeping. I guess I'll just have to sneak up on it at nighttime or something. Oh, they see me from a distance. I'm not too worried about filling out all of Pachirisu right now. Every Pokemon can be worked on little by little. What do you got there, friend? Poison powder. Number defeated. Number caught during daylight hours. Defeat with psychic moves. Come back with a psychic mod I'm training then. How about that? Uh, you can... Game? Y you can... There you go. That was weird. It wouldn't unlock from it. I don't know why it was doing that. Oops. Get this. Camera absolutely locked. It's like, remember last time I played? There was like a weird instance where the, um... The menu just refused to work for some, for some reason. I don't know why. an alpha toxicroak alpha quack so i wasn't able to investigate enough of the uh things right so now i can't do anymore right now i have to just wait for it to come back for it to happen again which is annoying all right i may as well leave and go to snow point or something oh wait i'm being chased that's right can't do that Thunderbolt it. Everything does too much damn damage to me. Make sure it dies by doing this, Porygon 2. I haven't seen any more Pikachus today, now that you mention it. Well, now that I think about it, rather. Hang on. 
I believe... Didn't you have a... Th Psyduck have a thing for, um... Electric moves. May as well grab a couple of these. Kill some ducks, chat. Make them pay for existing, apparently. Hang on. More ducks. Any sky stone? Staravia is another one I gotta just kind of grind for electric type moves. Probably just fight them at the coastlands or something. This is fine. Where the hell am I? I require this. And there's six wisps here. Oh, chat, I'm near Ursa's ring. I might just, I might just uh, play with the teddies again. Also, it's still raining. You mean rainstorm was gone, game. There could be a green bear. There could be. You never know. Where are the bears? Past Ursa's ring. Why have I not seen any Ursa's? Where are the Ursa's, chat? Was I lied to? There should be teddies running around here happily. If there isn't, I feel damn cheated. Sleeping? No, bears run around happy at all hours of the day. It's probably because of the weather. Teddy bears stay indoors during the rain, I guess. Bears gotta get comfy somehow. Um, you know what I realized? I haven't gone back to that, uh, little temple since, like, the start of the game. There's probably, like, an unknown or wisp in there. Let me go do that. Ooh, stretching slightly. Teddies are scared. Probably scared of the guy that keeps running through there, stealing them all. <laughs> They've gone in the hiding. Grabbed a shiny Infernape. Cool. I saw a swarm of Infernapes, but I didn't get none. Well, I didn't get a shiny of what I mean. I'm, a little I'm still really surprised I haven't found at least one more. With the amount of shinies people have been getting from this game, and with how frequently you're running in and out of encounters... I, I've kind of expected, like, to find at least a couple more by now. This was a waterfall. Not what I wanted, but... Hang on. Where is the thing in Crimson Mirelands? That's the lake. Uh... Shrouded Ruins is what I'm looking for. So let's just go up this way. Don't worry, it's just Lake Valor. There's a house in, with a teddy bear in there. Unlucky with shiny so far. That's what it seems like. I can't see a darn thing right now. It's now for Rhyhorn. Is that Bonsly? What the hell was that doing in there? Alright, I'll take it, I guess. The teddies were replaced by the Turtwig spawn, I suppose. Bonsly is rare. I could have sworn I saw it running around earlier, but now that you met, I haven't seen it since, I guess. Hang on. How did it get in there? Did I see a wisp behind my character? I think I did. All right then, Bonsly caught. 
Yeah, I do. Let me go get that. Oh, man. Looks like that's going to be an annoying one to farm, isn't it? I gotta break more ore deposits, apparently. Well, we'll get there when we get there. There's still tons of stuff to get in this dex. So don't worry. Sky stone. Oh, I didn't get any sky stone from that. But it was a blue rock. Come on. What if I talk to you now? Dissipated. Turn and wait for another one to happen. Alright, well, suit yourself. All turtwigs, twigs, and then that. Come for the first time. Only 4,000. That's like nothing, though. Turtwig's at level 10 now. Okay, good. Grodal level 10. So what is level 10? And same with Pachirisu. It is gonna be a long grind to 10 star. But that's what we're here to do. I think I'm gonna head to snow point now. Nothing I can do except wait for more of the uh the massive swarms to happen. If I wanna continue that. Nice peak camp. I don't remember where, how close either of the camps were to Snow Point. Play the Snow Point. Well, just go here then. And then just use Braviary to fly right up. Come on. Oh, there it is. Bit of a pain in the ass, but whatever. I thought I just saw a wisp for a second there. It's already at the three and a half hour mark. Jeez, chat. Why do I have to get lost playing this damn game? Hang on, that's... Oh, yeah, the lake is right next to Snow Point Temple. That's right. I really forgot that. And I already climbed uh, the temple before. Get in there. There's probably got to be, like, an unknown or something, like, hidden on one, behind wall one of these. I've seen the same tablet just everywhere. Okay. Mind your beeswax there, mister. I have to go around to the stairs that way, don't I? I hate how you can't just use weird air here. Uh -oh. Oops. I can just use the run, but... Blech. You run out of stamina way too quickly. Oh, wouldn't have expected to run into you up here. What are you up to? You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snow Point Temple, aren't you? That's what my clairvoyant, uh, clairvoyance told me. I tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange going on, Zaspri. This door here, well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. No matter what we do, this door just won't seem to open. The stone plate, iron plate, and icicle plate you're carrying. Oh! Alright, that's one way to do it. So, I guess the other reg the three Reggies aren't in this game, then. No catching them for fun. Just reacts to the three plates. If only were that simple. Original DS games, you had to transfer in... 
You had the transfer in from the Game Boy Advance game specifically. How did the Pokemon survive down here? The answer is they definitely did not. Uh-oh. Uh, Y'all just teleported ahead of me. Regigigas looks kind of silly. What in time is that thing? It's colossal. Sure seems to be a Pokemon. Let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Yep, yeah, definitely a Pokemon. My clairvoyance showed me a vision of it in motion. Guess I'll save. Just because I'm half paranoid, things are just gonna fall apart. After that Cresselia glitch was a thing. Hi. Zoot. Zoot. Oh, those things are supposed to light up? I never knew that. Does it not have its ability? What did that just say? I looked at chat and there was like a message there. I'm gonna YOLO ball it, because apparently that just works. It's, it's still slow. Regigigas has to have an ability still, I guess. Regigigas is the only Pokemon in this game with an ability. You obtained the blank plate. Wait, what? Was that a thing? No, there was no normal plate before, right? Because to make Arceus normal, you would just, like, remove its held plate. So I guess they invented it for this. Now, that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born of the very Earth. It's just an ordinary rock. And I guess this is just part of your job with the Survey Corps, huh? What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught, Asprey? Can't wait to see it in the Pokedex when it's done. Yep, yeah, pretty curious to read everything this professor writes up, too. See, Asprey. We should do another chase sometime. Alright. So, if I were to get the last plate... How much... Am I gonna be, like, locked into cutscenes for, like, 40 minutes? That's what I'm wondering. I better check if there's anything here. I would. Alright, if that's the case, I'll save getting the last plate for next time I stream this. Well, I don't get locked into the cutscenes. What I mean is, am I, is there going to be a bunch of stuff, a story for me to go through? Because if it is... I might as well just leave it for next time and do it all at once. Cause I don't if there's a if there's more story bits I have to go through, I don't wanna I don't wanna like split it up. I wanna do it all at once, but uh going three and a half hours with this already, I will save it for next time, I'd say. <laughs> Let me see if I can continue the alpha stuff. Definitely wait then, okay. Can I not just warp out of here? It's a lengthy conclusion. I can warp out of here. Good. Next time, I'll, I'll get the last plate next time, then. That'll, that'll be the plan. Anyhow. If I go back now, will I be able to go to Crimson Mirelands for anything? Let me see. See if the massive one's re re returned. 980. Undocumented. Only level 2. 20 points for catching a legendary. They really know how this works. I'm not distracted by distortions. I'm playing the game. This ain't no speed run. This ain't no cutscene percent. Uh, only a normal one for Perugly. 
I haven't really been to uh, the coastlands for a bit anyway, so let's pop in here for a tiny bit. And then we'll call it an episode. Anything level up? Nope. Things to electrocute here, though. That's for sure. Works for me. Okay. Where is the Perugly? It's up there. I guess I might as well deal with it. Time to fly. This place has the... Yeah, that's where Giratina is, but I can't do that right now. There's also, like, a, a seaside cave there for something. There are no shinies for me. There is a bit of a map I haven't checked. Where? Oh, this bottom corner? You're right, because this damn thing uh, blocks it. I will go there after. Let me go to the outbreak first. Easy to miss considering it's blocked off like that. Oh. I got hurt charging into it. Move, cat. There's already lots of Glamia right now. Uh-oh. And there's an Alpha Perugly. Serious? Hit him. Let me see here. Defeated. Seen it used play rough. Giving it food? Oh, wait, I gotta give it 20 pieces of food? Greedy cat. Absolutely very greedy chat. Also, let's kill this thing, because it's in the way. You want to mess with me, Butterfly? And how about I rip apart the universe for you? All this cat wants is food. No, they don't see me. Get some treats. Do they not like them? Nope. Okay, they do. Oh, there's that. Don't see anything over there. How did I not hit one of them? There's another one. Wish I had jet balls for this position here. <sighs> well, I caught it.
Come on, you know you want some. No shiny cats have appeared. There's one over there. Regular cat, I mean. That one is just, like, freaking out. Try they don't know where to go. They can't find a way to the berry. <laughs> Try it again. Have another. I'm using all the Ultra Balls today, aren't I? Caught without being spotted. Works too. No problem. Okay, I caught ten of them. What about you? You need food one, one more time. Go on. Eat it. They're just sitting there watching their friends get captured, and then they're just like, Yeah, we should keep eating. Oh, did you just, like, get stuck on that tree? Yes, you did. Oops. Oopsie. Go on. Have some. That one over there is just watching carefully, like, just watching his friends get- just disappear. Stunky can evolve. There. Bopped him hard. Report of Pokemon seems to be gone. That's all of them, I guess. And now I can get Golduck and Stunk Tank. I'll, fe I'll feed Snorlax 50 food items when I feel really, really bored. Maybe I should feed that Snorlax every time I walk by it. Just to get a head start, shouldn't I? Alright, before I end the episode, I want to go check that, um... I want to check that one spot in the corner of the map that I apparently have not seen. Quack. Yeah! Excellent. All right, to remove the marker from the map there. I'm trying to perfect the decks if I can, yeah. That's the balloon guy again. I don't want to deal with him. Oh, I see a wisp in the distance. Hang on. Is that- that was an alpha chancy. Come on, eat up. What are you doing? Leave that penguin alone. You're part of the Survey Corps, right? Could you help me out? It seems this Pokemon's so hungry that it can barely even move. I tried giving it food, but it wouldn't take a bite. I don't know if it's being stubborn or what. It showed some interest in plump beans, but it still wouldn't eat them. We can make a special. Of course, if we make the plump beans extra tasty, I'm sure this little deer will eat them. What kind of Supply Corps member am I to completely forget about crafting? In any case, maybe bean cakes will do the trick. Should you make me one? If you need the recipe, you can find at Craftworks. 
P P P penguin. How about I just catch the penguin? No, I cannot catch penguin. Do I have bean cakes to give? Probably just grab one at some point. This is just little chancy island, I guess. Let me lock on to it, please, so I can check its damn dex entry for what I need to do. Oh, hell with it. That's a screech if you've ever heard it. I'm just gonna take it out for the chunk of change it drops. Oh, I couldn't kill it. I think seeing it use double edge is needed. Chance for an Agile move, I guess. You are plopped. Well, they leveled up, but we don't really need that. Well, I found a Wisp by this spot, so that's something. Is that just more... Well, fish, okay. Oh, what's that? All right, Tombolo Walk. I guess so. Tranquility Cove. I don't remember how many Wisp I found. It said I had left for this area, but that's about it. All right, chat. Seems like a good place to stop. Holy heck, does time fly by running around in this damn game. All right, what do we got? I caught all these. The Alpha wasn't even part of the um, the swarm. I just caught it on the way there. All right, 5,000. Money's growing up there. Can sell all the gold I've been getting. New observations. Though impudent and difficult to tame, Perugly enjoys great popularity due to its fur, the be beauty of which surpasses even Velveteen. Its body is strong and has webbing on its hands and feet. Golduck can swim easily through rough seas, clawing its way through the high waves. Yeah, I guess that they don't want to... Say that, that Golduck looks like Kappas anymore. <laughs> Pokemon really has moved away from doing that for Golduck, haven't they? Now that more people kind of know the mythology of those things. Well, that certainly didn't stop Harvest Moon or Story of Seasons from letting you marry one, though. So what'd you like to do now? Return to Village. So I didn't end up getting the chance to see the Alpha Swarm, unfortunately. Maybe next time. Still, pretty cool. Dex is currently at 213 caught. I got tons of Pokemon at level 10. Um, just about all of the final evolutions of the starters are fully done. Hmm, I just gotta catch more of them. I can evolve Rallets for that. It takes quite a bit. I really gotta... I'm Fortunate reality of this, though, is that you really gotta settle in for a long grind for, like, the end of the Dex, I think. Um, but, like, while I'm training, or, like, I'll, that's the thing, I guess. I guess if I'm, like, hunting for shinies through, like, the swarms, I can also, um, just kind of get some Pokemon out and get, like, their 40 checks for using, like, Thunderbolt or something. Anyhow, maybe next time I'll change my outfit, but I actually really like this one a lot. It's nice. 42 hours. Damn. A lot. Completing's easy to do. Perfecting could definitely be hard, though. <clears throat> and that also requires you to do all the side quests and everything, too. Because some of the Pokedex entries legit just have a check for something that involves a side quest with them. Anyhow, for YouTube, this is where I guess this stops. Jeez, I'm doing so many long damn episodes of this. <clears throat> We're going to shift over to some Castlevania for a bit, though. So for YouTube, have a good night. Bye-bye.